Hi, I'm Dr. Sandra Laura Kramers, and many patients have asked me how to wash your face properly, so I want to show everybody how I do it. And it usually takes about five minutes in the morning, five minutes at night, depending on how much time you have. So basically, you just take some really hot water without burning your skin, uh, and then you take your hands, and then just wash your face like this 20 times or so. And as I do this, I push a little bit on my eyelid margin to basically push on the meibomian glands to allow the oil to come out. So I do that about 20 times in the morning, 20 times at night, and then I take a towel, clean towel, put it in some really hot water, and then just put it right on my eyes, just like that. Change it when it gets cold, dip it back in, do it like this for about five minutes in the morning, five minutes at night. Uh, and then I use a little bit of tea trail if I feel my eyelids in terms of crusting or burning or I feel like a sty is starting. And you can get diluted tea tree, you can get tea tree oil at CVS or Cleardex, which is a little bit easier to use. It comes in these little packets. Uh, this is just pure tea tree oil. You take a little bit of it, very, very diluted, so I get a wet towel and just take a tiny little mini drop. Close my eyes, scrub my eyelashes like I'm brushing my teeth. Keep doing that and leave it on for about a minute. And then after a minute, I wash off my face again. And it'll burn like the Dickens if it's there's bacteria in your eyelashes. Uh, if there's really no bacteria and you use a little bit, it shouldn't burn too much. But that will work to kill the bacteria and demodex mites on your eyelashes. And you can dilute it with water or mineral oil or even uh, heated up coconut oil. But you want to dilute it at least 50%. Some people need to dilute that even more or even Cleardex even more. If I'm starting to develop a sty, which some of us do from time to time, I take a really hot towel or a Q-tip and dip it in hot water, put it right over the area, change, it, put it back in when it gets cold, keep doing this, I'll call these like a hundred or a thousand times push-ups. Just keep doing that when it gets cold, dip it again, and that tries to open up the gland naturally. I've even been known to use my finger in really hot water and just push on that area and let the oil try to come out naturally uh, after the heat to try to open up that gland. And then we'll prescribe sometimes an ointment. This is called Neopolydexa. There's erythromycin and bacitracin. You use a little bit of this on a clean finger, put it on your finger, close your eyes, and just rub it into your eyelashes. You can do it like that. Go to bed in the morning you wash it off so you can get it off in the morning it'll blur the vision otherwise if you don't wash it off you can also use this on the inside of the eyelid if a sty is starting to form or if you've had surgery that's how i do it hope this helped